Hi, it's Bob Nagan, and in this episode of Real Retail TV, we're going to explore how I trained 120 mostly teenage employees to sell a mess of yo-yos. So back in the late 90s, the Mackinac Kite Company, my retail company, and our subsidiaries, uh, Yo-Yo Universe, sold millions of dollars worth of yo-yos. I don't know the exact number anymore, but I do know that in one week in December of 1998, we sold over a quarter of a million dollars worth of yo-yo and yo-yo accessories. How do I know that? because every Saturday night after they closed, our Yo-Yo Universe kiosk stores had to fax in their sales numbers. And both my brother Steve and I, at the same time, we didn't know each other, we didn't know that we were coming, went to the office to see. We were selling so many yo-yos. And when we added up our 15 stores or 13 stores, there was over a quarter of a million dollars. And man, oh man, was it was exciting stuff. But what's the lesson for you? You see, in order to sell that many yo-yos, in order to create yo-yo booms, we didn't sell yo-yos, we created yo-yo players. This is an important distinction. If a kid got a yo-yo for Christmas or a kid bought a yo-yo for themselves, the enemy was the bedside uh, drawer, was the drawer in the living room. Our challenge as a company was to get the kids playing to get the kids enthusiastic about learning tricks, to get them excited about collecting, to get them excited about getting better and sharing their newfound joy of yo-yo play with their friends. And so here's where it gets interesting for you. We had to sell correctly in order for this to happen. And what did that mean? It meant when a kid bought his first yo-yo, two, th three things had to happen. First of all, they had to buy the bundle. They couldn't buy the least expensive yo-yo. They had to buy a Yomega with a brain. Why? Because a Yomega with a brain was the easiest yo-yo to learn on. Then they had to buy a, in the bundle was a Yomega with a brain, a six pack of replacement strings because strings wear out. And when a string wore out, we wanted them to be able to replace it immediately. Why? We wanted them to keep playing. And finally, the, the final piece of the bundle was a trick book. Why? Because if they became bored, they would quit playing, but if there were always more challenging tricks, they would keep learning, they would keep playing. So step number one, sell them the bundle. Step number two, cut the string the right length. So if a kid was short and the string was too long, when they threw the yo-yo down, it would hit the ground and break. Bad deal. We wanted them to be successful, so we cut the string down. The third thing is we taught them how to throw a sleeper. The Omega Brain was a super easy yo-yo to learn with, and it was super easy to get a, a sleeper. So part of this selling process was they needed to leave knowing how to throw a sleeper. They needed to have success. So. This was a cool little deal and it worked like crazy for us. And we had 120 mostly teenage employees, mostly boys, doing this all the exact same way. How did we do it? What does this mean for you? It means that we created this process called the Goof Proof Training Process. And the Goof Proof 
training process that we used with all of our Yo-Yo Universe employees and all of our Mackinac Kite Company employees and that you can use in your business goes like this. First, you write it down into a manual. If it ain't written, it ain't real. But what we found when we had a manual is we would give it to people, but we didn't know that they read it. We didn't know that they understood it. We had them sign it, but it didn't mean anything. So we thought, well, wait a second. Let's make a video. A video engages more learning styles, right? So now, uh, so my brother Steve came in and he had this giant camcorder. He had just had his first baby. And uh, so he had to have a camcorder, right? And so I just made a video. I said, this video is a one shot wonder. If I burp, if I pick my nose, I apologize, but basically I did a training program as if there were actual new employees in the room. There was no way to edit these things. It was on a big VHS tape, but now we had a manual and a video. But here's what we found. We would send somebody to the stock room, to the basement, to the office, with their new manual to watch the video. But what we found was people didn't know all the information. So then we created an open book test. So now when they went to the office to watch the video along with their manual, they took this test as they went along, right? Now we knew that they were actually paying attention. The next step was we had them demonstrate to us that they knew how to do what we were talking about. So we had them demonstrate selling the bundle. We had them demonstrate to us that they knew how to cut the string to length. We had them demonstrate to us how they would uh, throw a sleeper. You see, now we knew that they knew and they knew that we knew that they knew. So now there were no excuses for them not to do it the right way every single time. And then the final part of the goof proof training program is a couple weeks later, we had them go back and take that exact same open book course, uh, uh, open book test, I'm sorry, again. We needed to make sure that they had retained the information. It worked like a charm. It has been proven to work again and again and again. And one of the reasons that we are so excited for you is that the new Retail Sales Academy Plus that is just being introduced right now gives you the ability to create the manual, put your training on a platform, have the testing built in. It gives you the ability to take all of your training and put it in one place. And it's not just the training for your business, it's also there with the Retail Sales Academy. So if you're really looking to up your game, if you're really looking to up the culture in your business, if you want to have a team full of incredibly highly trained people, you owe it to yourself to check out the new Retail Sales Academy Plus. The link is down below and right now until July 15, there is a tremendous bonus package that comes when you sign up for the Retail Sales Academy Plus. But you're a smart, independent retailer. You're watching this episode of Real Retail TV. Uh, you owe it to yourself. I just, I'll just say it that way. I hate to come off that strong, but I will. You owe it to yourself to check it out. I think that it is such a wonderful, wonderful tool to help you build your business. And your business is important to us. So click on the link, see what you, I mean, check out their new Retail Sales Academy Plus. 
If you have any questions about the Retail Sales Academy Plus, put them in the comments below or call our office. If you're already using the new Retail Sales Academy Plus and you've got some great things to say, I'd appreciate it if you put that down below too. All right, everybody, I'm Bob Nagan. I hope that the goof proof training process is helpful to you and your business. And uh, we'll see you next week. Mm -hmm.